Hello YouTube. Well, I've got my last piece running. Got the WP Davis hooked up. At the current time, it'll only run in back gear. For some reason, the spindle's too stiff. Don't have enough torque. My belt slipped. And, uh, but, this is the jack shaft. Now this right here is the tight pulley. And this one right here is the loose pulley. And uh, this is a inch and three sixteenths uh, shaft on the on the jack shaft. And these pulleys are about uh, just a little over a, about 10, 12 thousandths over an inch and a quarter, which is I'm just not sure what that holds for. Both these pulleys are the are like twins. So this one I got a little um, uh, bushing to put in there, and it runs all right. I mean, they run about as straight as the rest of the pulleys on here. I got the hub turned on that one. Put it up a while back. And uh, in order to get the loose pulley, I got a, a board out on this lathe because the other lathe is not big enough. And uh, so this lathe, I'm going to put this lathe to work making parts for itself. And uh, I, I'm think, I think I'll speed it up a little bit. I'm running on the second to the slowest pulley the back, back here. And for boring these, I found uh, with the belt slip, uh, I need more torque. Uh, I had to tighten this pulley up here to even get it to run. And uh, it's running. I think uh, this will work. I can bore this out. Basically, I'm just going to drill it out. Use a inch and 716. I got these uh, bushings. I got little oil grooves in them. Want to go in each end. It's what I could get at the moment to make it work. I put a couple of uh, drip oilers on here. I've I've actually put a couple drip oilers on my star lathe because um, when I'm running these, I'm gonna excess oil them, keep the oil running. <clears throat> I've added, I did a couple other little things. That's why I haven't posted lately. It took me so long to get this running. I just laced up, <laughs> laced up these belts and. Had to, had to cut them down. They started out a little too loose. Like I said, I'm, I'm running my belts way too loose anyway. And later on, I don't know, I may tighten them up a little bit, make things work. But because I'm going out there to the fair, I have to be com comfortable. So what I did, you can see these supports coming out here. And I put a, a porch swing it turns into a futon, and uh, I'm gonna be comfortable. I'm gonna give him a, a lap of luxury here. If uh, if things get a little slow, I get a little tired. Shoot, I'll just uh, jump over there on the porch swing, drop the back down, take myself a little nap. This uh, little little machine shop is uh, becoming much more habitable for me. <laughs> well, just a small update, and uh, it, uh, thanks uh, everybody out there for subscribing and viewing. And if you have any comments, uh, go ahead and leave them. And, uh, 
I'll talk to you later. Bye.